Hi there, my name is Terry and this is 5 Minute Bellow. It's a beautiful sunny day today here in the Cambridgeshire countryside, so I've come out for a ride. It was about 25 degrees centigrade when I left home, and I've climbed up about 130 metres. Because of the temperature and the sweat of course, I thought it would be a good idea to talk about overheating, or rather not overheating. So today I'm just going to talk a bit about the solution that I use to keep my head cool. What's the real issue here? Well, it's that I sweat a lot. The sweat can run down my forehead and into my eyes, causing them to sting, and also cause smears on my glasses, which further restricts my vision. For normal people, your eyebrows are supposed to stop the sweat going in your eyes. But for me, I'm not very well endowed in that department. Now to deal with this problem that I have, I've come up with a technological solution. I call it an enhanced unibrow with integrated gutters for sweat, or earwigs for short. Now I'd be the first to admit that I haven't worked out all of the details of the earwig system. So for now I'll carry on using the method that I've been using for many years. Well, it's the humble cycling cap. So how does it work? Well, it's quite simple really. You just put it on your head, like so, and then put your helmet on over the top. Well, of course, I can't see where I'm going now because the peak is in the way. So I just flip it up like that. So how does this actually keep my head cool and keep sweat out of my eyes? Well, any sweat that runs down will meet the base of the peak and get absorbed into the material so it doesn't go into my eyes and makes the peak wet. Because the peak is wet, it forms an evaporative cooling fin. That cooling is transferred to my forehead and helps keep my head cool. If you're one of those fortunate people that don't sweat very much, you can get some clean water from one of your water bottles and just place it behind the peak, making the peak wet and therefore cooling your forehead. Please subscribe and click on the bell icon to get notification of future videos. If you're going to wet the peak, I suggest you use clean water because I've tried energy gel and that didn't work very well.